If you haven't been following this, like rap beefs have gone to another level. <laughs> Basically, Drake is beefing with Pusha T. And if you've been following hip hop, you'll know that for a while, rap beefs have been pretty, pretty benign. You know, it's just been like, I rap good, you rap bad. <laughs> and, then, uh, and then Drake and Pusha T started a new beef. And then Pusha T started it. Drake responded, you know, standard stuff. You can't rap, I can rap. And then Pusha T came out with a new track yesterday where he went in on Drake like I've never, like, I didn't know it was ever possible. <laughs> he, he went in on like, oh, your, your mom, like your dad left your mom when you were five years old, your dad abandoned you, and your mom's never been in a, a marriage. And, and also when you were 17, you had issues with your skin color and you were afraid to grow out your hair because you couldn't grow an afro and you didn't know if you were black enough. And oh, and also you have a secret child by a French porn star. <laughs> Uh, and this was your child's name, and this is, and it's just like, wait, what? <laughs> and I'm sitting, I've never ever seen, like, it's like, it's a level of investigation that has gone into <laughs> rap. Like, this is something that you reserve for presidential campaigns, <laughs> and Pusha T clearly hired, like, a full-on research team. It was like, I want to know everything about Drake. <laughs> and now, like, there's information that's out now, and everyone's just like, wait, is this true? How do you even know this stuff? I bet Robert Mueller heard the track and he was like, I need Pusha T on my team. <laughs> Who is this guy? <laughs> to, like, it's one thing. I've heard rap beefs where people threaten to get rid of family members. I've never heard of rap beefs where people give you family members. <laughs> like, Drake discovered he has new family members out of a rap beef. That is next level. Like, Pusha T, like, 23 and me, Drake, in a beef. <laughs> That's insane. It's just like, yeah, you whack, you whack, and you can rap. And he's like, okay, give me that microphone, a strand of your hair. We're gonna find out some shit here. <laughs> you, you, oh, we're gonna see when I come back. We're gonna find out things about your grandfather, my friend.